really good deer right there uh, with a doe. We've been watching him from up top and we just moved in right here. His deer's got a lot of mass, uh, got a lot of sticker and kicker points off of him. Uh, probably been watching him for about a half hour. He's just standing right there. It's just real hard to get to him. We think about trying to do a stalk, uh, you know, get onto him. There's a lot of deer out there in the field, so. Where we are right now, we've uh, probably made our way about 800 to 1,000 yards down this river. The alfalfa field's up above us in this corner down here where that big buck is. What we're gonna try to do is just work our way down and we're almost where it wanna pop up. Uh, I think we can get real close to him. Look at this big Montana whitetail. What a big deer. Look at all the sticker and kicker points on this deer. This is a great, great whitetail. Let's take a look at him. Big body. Let me just get over that first. Big body. Probably close to 300 pounds, but I want you to look at this rack. This is absolutely incredible right here. Uh, big, big deer. We got a lot of mass. Uh, I'm going to count him up for us real quick. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20. Looks like we have around 20 scoreable points on him. But what a great, great, great deer. You know, let me tell you real quick what happened this morning, which you saw. We binoculated this deer from some far off hills. Saw him go out right here behind us in the corner. We went and got our stuff. Uh, to come back and before we got back they were about back out in this field we couldn't get to our tree stands so what we had to do was get probably a thousand yards off we dropped off underneath the river ledge made our way all the way up underneath and ironically enough made it all the way to our tree stands but we had to sit up underneath it but I'm telling you uh, probably a 200 yard shot uh, made a good shot the first shot and just proud of this deer that is a great Montana whitetail